tiny rainbow chocolate and huge colorful candies? Mini cookies and giant marshmallow fluff? We've got sweet treats for unicorns, big and small. Watch our new video to learn how to prepare giant and mini desserts for unicorns. Miss Gonzalez is napping, and Unicorn decides to make the most of this. She can eat as many forbidden candies as she can handle. But her sweet Utopia is disturbed by the doorbell ringing. Who's there? Is it a cavity? Unicorn opens the door. There's a mysterious parcel waiting there. Oh gosh, it's moving! What's inside? It smells like candy and marshmallows. And here's a tiny hand. I need to coax this little creature out quick. Unicorn has the perfect bait. A mini bar of Hershey's. Melt white chocolate glaze in a microwave. Add food coloring of rainbow shades. Pour the melted glaze into a silicone mold of a small chocolate bar interchanging colors. Let chill in a fridge for 15 minutes. Print out a mini Hershey's label with a unicorn print on sticker paper. Put the mini bar inside and close the package. What an adorable rainbow! It's a unicorn, just super tiny! This is the baby unicorn, Sophie! Unicorns of all ages love chocolate! Sophie studies her bigger twin. Unicorn isn't used to kids. Oh goodness! Help me, Miss Gonzalez! Miss Gonzalez is seeing double. Where did the second unicorn come from? And what should we do with this baby now? The unicorn starts stress eating her sweet marshmallow fluff. Cover a big container from protein powder with acrylic primer. Coat it with a rainbow of acrylic paints. Make a gradient. Beat six egg whites into thick foam. Pour seven ounces of corn syrup into 14 ounces of sugar. And add five and a half ounces of water. Cook it for eight minutes, stirring. Keep beating the egg whites and gradually stir in the hot syrup. Beat for another four minutes. Divide the mass into three parts and add food coloring. Put the fluff into the container. Label the container. Sophie's looking dreamily at the rainbow fluff. She loves sweet food so much. Here you go. Miss Gonzalez rushes to the kitchen to make a treat for her guest. Sophie refuses to eat grown-up food. She needs mini sweets for little kids. A whole herd of unicorns stampedes into Miss Gonzalez's kitchen. Sit at the table, behave yourselves. Unicorns hate waiting. Where's our food? Melt 53 ounces of icing in a double boiler. Add food coloring. Make colorful swirls. Pour the glaze into a round mold. Spread it over the walls. Let it chill. Make a circle of glaze on parchment paper. This'll be the base of the candy. Add 18 ounces of heated cream to 25 ounces of milk chocolate. Mix until the chocolate melts. Pour the cooled chocolate filling into the mold. Cover it with the lid and seal it with glaze. Make a few candies. Put them together. Wrap them in tin foil. Attach a printed out Rollo label. Miss Gonzalez made a giant Rollo. Hands off, big unicorn! This is a treat for our little guest. But Sophie doesn't like the giant food. She's still too small. Don't be sad, Miss Gonzalez. Unicorn knows what to feed her mini-me with. Mini food, like mini go-go clusters. 
Cut circles out of a cracker using the tip of a pastry syringe. Melt marshmallows and put them onto the cracker. Put peanuts into a Ziploc bag and crush them. Pour caramel topping over the crackers and sprinkle the peanuts on top. Add food coloring to melted chocolate and pour a few different colors over the cookies at once. Put the rainbow cookies into a mini Go-Go Clusters package. Sophie gets her little cookies. This is the perfect size for her. It's delicious! The adults are glad they made the little one happy. That also means Unicorn can keep the giant Rolo for herself. All these rainbow sweets are so yummy. I can't get enough. Miss Gonzalez is happy when everyone's eating. Now she knows how to feed every possible size of Unicorn. Miss Gonzalez wants to coax a smile out of little Sophie. She made special mini Whoppers. Add food coloring to melted chocolate glaze. Dip rice balls into the colored glaze and let them dry on parchment paper. Put the colored spheres into a mini package with a unicorn on it. These rainbow whoppers are the tastiest thing in the world. Sophie's so happy. And the big unicorn feels forgotten and neglected. How could this happen? It's so unfair. Miss Gonzalez notices unicorn's hurt feelings. Don't be jealous. You'll always be my favorite rainbow creature. No baby could ever change that. Unicorn made friends with a rainbow baby. They're having fun playing together. Miss Gonzalez is pleased. She just made a giant Reese's cup for her guests. Melt 25 ounces of white chocolate drops in a microwave. Divide it into parts and add food coloring. Put the chocolate into baking molds. Let it cool. Mix peanut butter with puffed rice for the filling. Put the filling into the molds. Spread it out evenly and pour the colored chocolate on top. When the chocolate is fully cooled, put the candy in a square paper wrapper. Seal it with double-sided tape. Attach a printed out Reese's logo with a unicorn. Unicorn opens the candy. But it's too big for Sophie. Unicorn bites off her rainbow candy. Mmm, delicious! And she breaks off a little piece for little Sophie. The perfect solution. You can just divide the candy. But while Unicorn went off to get a knife, the candy disappeared without a trace. Where did it go? Sophie insists she had nothing to do with it. The unicorns are cooking up a surprise for Miss Gonzalez. Their preparations are intense. There's a culinary tornado happening in the kitchen. Miss Gonzalez is horrified. What did these unicorns do to her kitchen? Patience, Miss Gonzalez. We made a sweet surprise for you. Mini Twinkies. Pour four and a half ounces of sugar into one and three fourths ounces of vegetable oil. Add two egg yolks. Pour in one and three fourths ounces of milk. Mix thoroughly. Add baking powder to three and a third ounces of flour. And pour the flour into the mixture. Mix a batter. Divide it into parts and add food coloring. Pour the batter into Ziploc bags and squeeze it out onto parchment paper into small stripes. Bake the colorful cakes for 15 minutes. Adjust the edges of the finished cakes. Poke a hole in the center of each one with a wooden skewer. Fill the cakes with colorful whipped cream using a syringe. 
put the colorful cakes into a mini Twinkies box with a picture of a unicorn. Miss Gonzalez loves snack cakes, especially rainbow ones. Thank you, my sweet unicorns. Now we'll each have a sweet, tiny Twinkie. Miss Gonzalez made a giant gummy bear. Where did her unicorn family go? They should get started on eating this as soon as possible. Pour a quarter gallon of cold water over four and a half ounces of gelatin. Let the gelatin set and melt it in a microwave. Pour five ounces of sugar into the gelatin. Mix thoroughly. Divide the mix into four parts. Add food coloring to each one. Pour the colorful jelly layer by layer into a silicone bear mold. Let each layer set so the colors don't mix. Remove the gummy bear out of the mold when it's ready. Unicorn is so happy to try this big bear. And Sophie turns it into a whole lot of little gummy bear cubs. Now she can eat her fill. This size of gummy bear is much better. Did you like our sweet recipes? Then let us know in the comments about which ones you'd like to try, tiny or huge. And don't forget to like this video. Subscribe to our channel and click on the bell so you don't miss new unicorn treats from Troom Troom.